Hey everybody, it's Masuka. Welcome back to Pokemon Emerald. It's been two and a half weeks, and I don't know what I did last day, so... Well, I do know what I did last day, because I edited the part yesterday, which would be April 5th, <laughs> for me. But, uh, I don't know what I did in between parts, because it's been a long time, and I've been busy doing other things. But we had to challenge a gym in this city, and I don't even know what the city's called. Where the devil am I? <laughs> Where in the Pokemon universe am I? I'm at Fortree City. Alright. Uh, okay. We're in Fortree City. We were doing a gym battle today. <laughs> I don't know what happened last time. Well, I guess I do know what happened last time because I only edited the part, but I don't recall doing much. Although I did probably didn't do much off screen, but it's been two and a half weeks. It was April, or not April, May, March. May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. I was doing them all. Um, it's been March 18th. That would be two and a half weeks since I last touched this. And that would be the last time I've recorded it. So I don't know what I did off screen in between that. So we'll have to wait till we get to a Pokemon Center. Or a Pokemon Center back in the city. Just to see what we did. Obviously I grinded to level 41. But I don't know. I remember catching a Pokemon and nicknaming it after someone. But uh, we'll check the Pokemon Center out after the gym. Um, so yeah, Basuk, what have you been doing for the last two and a half weeks? I've been studying my keister off like crazy. Like crazy. Like uber crazy. That's even a, a legit term, but whatever. Um, my exam was yesterday, the 5th of April, today is the 6th, and, uh, but I, I've been studying way before that, like I started studying, I'd say about a month ago, a month to this date, which is the 6th, so March 6th, that's about right, off and on, uh, even though the course material wasn't even finished, but I wrote my final exam last night, April 5th, and, um, it, it went really well, like, studying for that length of time and knowing my material that well really paid off. I mentioned it on Facebook. There, I know there's a few people who, I'm, who are subscribed to me that are on my Facebook, my real Facebook. And I left a comment and I said, like, it's a really good feeling when you walk out of an exam knowing you did well. It's an even better feeling when your instructor emails you saying that you got such and such a mark. So that happened. <laughs> um, by the time I finished my exam and, and drove home from the college, which wasn't that long, maybe it... Well, it was stormy, so it was, we, had, we, had, we were still in winter here. We had a winter storm yesterday. Um, by the time I got home, uh, my instructor emailed me saying, congratulations, you got such and such a mark. So, I have that stress, and I don't usually get stressed out. I have that, I'll call it stress, just to make it easier. I have that stress out of the way now. Past my course. I just have one thing, we all have one thing left to do in the course, but one thing left, and that is to, uh, we have a work term. I have mine in about a week from Monday. I think it's the 18th and 19th of April. So I have to go back to the hospital environment and, uh, get a few things for training done in there, and then I'm totally done with the course. So that's pretty amazing. Why do I remember that? Whatever. <laughs> so that's, that's a good feeling. So that's what I was doing away from this for the last two and a half weeks to a month. Whenever I needed a study break, I think I mentioned it in some of the videos, like I had a hand cramp from writing and all that stuff. I would come to this, but once I got to like a certain point, I just stopped this recording all together. Just to focus. So, um... That was that. There wasn't much else going on. I would really like to know what I did between parts, but I don't remember. It's fine. So the classroom environment is finished. I got the work term coming up. 
And then I'm totally done. Oh look, it's a gamer ID from Gen 2. Hi <laughs> gamer ID from Gen 2. <laughs> it's a sad I remember that. And I remember Aaron was do duo. That's pretty cool. Um myself and the girlfriend have been house hunting for the last well, we've been doing it since February. Looking for houses. We haven't really seriously looked for houses. We have in the last maybe three weeks. We haven't found anything yet. But we just want something bigger. We want to get out of our neighborhood right now. We want to get somewhere closer to like where the hospitals would be because that's where we're going to be working. Well, that's where she works and I, I will be working in one of two hospitals in the city and like find somewhere like in the middle. It'd be great. We wouldn't have too much travel time. Like it's not too much travel time now. It's probably about for her work. It's probably about 15 minutes for mine. It probably might, might be about 20. If we got somewhere closer, like we could even reduce to one car if we wanted to. But um, yeah, we're looking for a bigger place with at least a basement and a in a full room for my gaming stuff. <laughs> rather than sharing the room. So that's a slow process, but, you know, it is what it is. We haven't found, we found a few things that we like, but, but, it's, you know, not exactly what we're looking for at the same time. Or we were waiting for me to finish my exam so I wouldn't have the stress of, um, Mortgage brokers, you know, inspections, showing the house and all that stuff, so... Showing this house. I gotta do that. But, um, yeah, it's, it's a slow process, but we're getting through it eventually. Hopefully we'll have something soon. Alright, gym leader. I'm Anona. I am the leader of the Fortry Pokemon Gym. I have become one with bird Pokemon, and I have soared the skies. However grueling the battle, we have triumphed with grace. Witness the elegant choreography of bird Pokemon and I. Wasn't there two? Like, wasn't there? Weren't they a twin? Like a boy and girl twin in the anime? I think there was. And I think Ash's Taylo and Pikachu battled, and Taylo. I think it was a Swellow though. It evolved to a swallow. And, uh, yes, I'm remembering. Pikachu used Thunderbolt on it and it turned golden. Like, how is that possible? Super effective. Whatever. It's Ash. <laughs> Ash can do interesting things. Altaria, I will switch. To my Altaria. Oh, you have an item, do you, Linoon? I just. I don't even know what moves these Pokemon have. <laughs> right on. Dragon Breath! Good. That's fine because if I just take you, you're gonna heal now, aren't you, Manana? Maybe not, because is my going to green that way? Oh, you're a silly, silly, silly Pokemon. You should have not ate that, because then you probably would have got a full heal. Way to go, Angel Star. What else you got? Trophius. I uh, switch. No, you know Peck, don't you? Stay in. You need something stronger than Peck. We need Wing Attack. Or Aerial Ace. Oh, you're gonna heal now. Maybe not. What is with these Pokemon and healing? Now this isn't gonna be super effective or anything, but it might do more damage in a peck. Synthesis! I also got a uh, new app on my phone. Uh, Meetomo. 
I think that's the Nintendo app using your Mies. Stop using sentences! <laughs> Oh my god! You're the worst! I'm half time to do that just so it flinches, but I know it's not gonna do much damage. There we go. You are the worst Pokemon ever. Banana chins. <laughs> Brutal. Must have ran out of PP and synthesis. But yeah, meet Tomo. And what it does is, um... It's, it's like a place for your Miis to talk to your other Miis, whether you're connect to your Nintendo, which they haven't really done that, because I have friends on my Nintendo, Wii U, and 3DS, and they're not there, so it's... They do it through Facebook and Twitter, and face-to-face, uh, -face, like if you're in the same room with someone. I haven't done that. I might have to con the girlfriend into doing that one. But you get points, and you can use your points on uh, MyNintendo.com, and you can eventually buy stuff when you get enough. But you can get, like, it's pretty interesting, it's just a bunch of questions, like you're constantly asking and answering questions about your friends and about yourself. So, it's pretty neat, like, for what it is. But, uh, I've been at that for a few days now. We defeated Winona! She has, like, Latios ears and, and a tail, even though Latios or Latias aren't that color. Maybe it's the Mega Form. Before it was even the Mega Form. Cool. Three hundred bucks. Save the feather badge. Oh yeah! All Pokemon up to level seventy, even those received through trades, will obey your every command. You will also be able to use each and move fly outside of battle. And this, this is a gift from me. TM forty. Is that Aerial Ace? Because that's the only movement that I saw. Aerial Ace. It's speed. No. Pokemon should be able to avoid it. And we registered. Cool, man! Yay! You did it! You achieved liftoff. And we can fly! That's amazing. Oh, excuse me, I have to get this. Hi, I'm Asuka, it's me! Just as I thought, you won at the Fort Tree Gym. Your strength, perhaps you really are the trainer that I've been searching for. Remember, you have a fan in me. I have a fan. <laughs> Sorry. I'll be sharing you from the sidelines. Keep up the great work. Alright, let's go see what I did in between parts. Because I don't remember. Go heal first. Good job, Poke Pals. That was good. My electric types. I'm gonna put you away now, though. I think I might teach Angel Star Fly. I know I originally had a uh, Swallow Amethyst in there, but <sighs> I feel like I've been using that one for a long time. So we'll deposit my electric and that one. And we will withdraw. Okay, so Christian evolved. Good for you. You're a slacking. Uh, KJ evolved. You're an Agron. Good for you. I'll take you back out because I might need Surf. Um. Gamalaki's level 41. Does he know any good moves now? I feel like he does, even though I don't remember. Razor Wind. That's a new one. Okay. And I have an Absol. Where did, when did I get an Absol? <laughs> I named it uh, Stagatron after a good Canadian buddy. Where did I catch it? Root. Venom Root. Uh, 120. 
That's just over on the other side of this city, isn't it? I think. Okay. Um... Let's take you out for a spin, because I don't know anything. Swallow, Apostle, Pig... Oh, hello, off-screen. Off-screen, we evolve my Barboach, my Whalmer, my Tentacool, my... Um... I have an Exploud. That evolved. Grimer evolved, and... Balto evolved. Okay. I don't know when I did that. Well, somewhere between the last two and a half weeks. Okay. Um, so that's everything that I have now evolved that can evolve without trading or stones. Um, except for this one. This one hasn't evolved yet. I think it's level 45 though, so I'm not really there anyway. Cool. Oh, uh, that's what I did off screen, I guess. I didn't teach um, Ontario fly. And I'm gonna fly home because I remember uh, when I edited the last part. I think May might have said I should go fly home, visit my parent, my mother, and um, Dorman said the same thing when I beat him in the gym. We're getting rid of Astonish. There we go. That's gone. Okay. And let's use that right away. And fly to Little Root. There we go. I don't know if there's any purpose to see Mom, but we'll go anyway. Hey, motor! I'm home! For a quick visit. Where's the honey Pokenav? Some of them Devin gave you. Well, honey, you have a tertiary. Mom! Uh, Mom, you better not call me at all hours of the night. Why did Dad give you that badge? Here's something from your mom. Ah! Uh, amulet coin! That's why he wanted me to come home. Should I use that from the get-go? Anyway, whatever. We have amulet coin, which doubles money that we get in battle. I will give it to Grow or Septile, just to give it out. All right. I got a feeling we can go back to the Trick Master now too, but I won't. Not yet. Uh, so now we can fly back. To here. I'm. I'm gonna end this part when we get to the other side because I want to. Uh, rather than just get a little ways in, have to stop the video and and not giving uh, Stegatron the Absol time to much screen time, or any screen time. We'll just end it. Call it a day. So this is where we got... Oh yeah, we got the, the Devon scope here from Steven. That's right. And we can see the cat clans. Ah, cool. It rains all the time, so the thunder would always hit. I should have left Trouble Hunter in. Anyway, we'll end off here for today. Next day, we'll explore this Route 120. I'm going to make sure I put Absol Stagatron in right away, test them out, and uh, yeah, that's it. I'm Mizuka, thanks for watching, Poker Pals, and we'll see you next video.